The update on the numbers of coronavirus cases here in Georgia. So far, the Atlanta-based Centers for Disease Control and Prevention is confirming six cases of COVID-19. Another 11 patients have presumptive positive cases, and that means they're awaiting a second positive result from the CDC. Meanwhile, there's been a delay in the arrival here in Georgia of passengers from that cruise ship tainted by the virus. CBS 46's Rebecca Schramm reports from Dobbins Air Reserve Base in Marietta. The folks here at Dobbins tell us they are ready to quarantine as many as 151 people if necessary. The question is, when will the cruise ship passengers get here? It's so good to be outside. The first round of passengers from the Princess Cruises ship Grand Princess finally stepped foot on dry land in California Monday, some for the first time in 18 days. But disembarking is a slow process. The first priority, getting the sickest patients, including the 21 who've tested positive for COVID-19 to secure medical facilities. Then comes triage for the others. Late Monday, buses finally began taking healthy passengers to quarantine sites but at least several hundred remained on the ship for another night. We're all in our rooms still or out on our balconies. We have plenty of fresh air. And when we leave the ship, we all be wearing masks. So I think we're pretty safe going. We're getting to where we're going to be going. Debbie Loftus of Wisconsin remained on board with her parents. My parents are nervous just because of their age and because of the, my mother's asthma. But we feel very healthy and um, we're just praying that we weren't exposed. We're working to get a timeline of when the 34 passengers from Georgia, along with others who live in the eastern United States, will arrive at Dobbins Air Reserve Base in Marietta. If anyone tests positive for coronavirus while at Dobbins, he or she will be taken to a medical facility as directed by federal health officials. In Marietta, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News.